Hello. Today we're going to talk about how to conduct a CV risk calculation. This is a test patient, a 54 year old male who has a cholesterol panel, some vitals of blood pressure. He also has a history of diabetes and he is currently a smoker, but he has no family history of heart disease. So first of all, we have to locate the Framingham risk score. So you click on the Securo symbol, go up to tools, scroll down, and find the Framingham risk calculator. So some of the demographics fill in themselves. So we just need to check that he is a smoker. He is a diabetic. Blood pressure comes in automatically, but if he were being treated, you would need to click on that. His total cholesterol needs to be added manually. So we'll do that. His HDL needs to be added manually. And also if he has a cardiovascular family history, you would click on that. So this gentleman has a risk score of 30%. So okay. Now that inserts into a note within the EMR and you can search for it, but we like to include it in the screening bar. I would recommend that you use uh, something called the CV risk calculation. Put today's date here because you're going to do serial ones in the future. And just put 30%. Oops. 30%. Uh, so like when you do another one next year, you would just add in August. 2017 whatever whatever you would do so you add in serial ones that way so save and close so that's nice and easy to see that he had a CV risk calculation done now for ease I would suggest that you add Framingham risk score into this area here called the doc action bar so you don't have to search for it at all so I'll just quickly show you how to do that you go to file user preferences display Configure Actions, uh, click on Framing Amherst Calculator, add it, apply, OK. And so now it's sitting here. It's just the same thing, except you don't have to go searching for it.